everyone in this video today i'm gonna show you how to make healthy beetroot wine and this wine is my personal favorite so here goes the recipe we need 1 kg beetroot which i have grated it And we need cardamom, cloves, cinnamon stick which I have broken into small pieces, grated ginger, lime juice, handful of dry grapes, handful of wheat. Last thing we need 1 kg sugar. In a vessel add 3 liters of water on a stove. Now add grated beetroot into it. Make sure you use a wooden spoon whenever you stir it. Stir it and let it cook for 10 minutes. Now add grated ginger into it. And give a quick stir. Now add half kg of sugar. Stir it well until the sugar does not melt. If you are new to my channel, do subscribe and hit the bell icon to get the new updates. Keep stirring in between. Let it cook for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, you can see the beetroot has changed the color. Now you can turn off the flame and let it cool down completely. After cooling down, take a ceramic jar or a glass jar and strain the mixture. the excess juice from it
add half liter of water and squeeze the excess into the bowl. For 1 kg beetroot, you need 3 and half liters of water. Squeeze it well and discard the leftover. Now add half kg sugar. Add rest ingredients one by one. Lastly, we'll add the key ingredient, which is yeast. I have mixed with little sugar and warm water and ferment it. Mix it well until the sugar dissolves and the rest ingredients mix up really well. Cover it with a lid or any cloth can do. Tie it and keep it for 14 days in a cool dark place. Every alternate days make sure to stir it with a wooden spoon. So after 14 days, I'm going to uncover it and strain it to a vessel. As you can see, the wine is ready. You get the sweet smell of wine. Let's strain it in the vessel. Once the straining is done, I'm gonna bottle it. Do give a try to this recipe and let me know in the comment section. After bottling it, I'll be keeping it for more 5 days. So this is called the secondary fermentation.
after five days, the wine is 